Let me go with everybody all time favorite and y'all already know which one this is. Hey, hey Glam Squad. I know I am late with this video, but this is a review on both of the Anastasia Beverly Hills lip liner set I got. I got cool brown and malt. Now, I can tell y'all I was in love with this color, but I know it probably will not work on me. It'll probably look with someone way lighter than me. So I'm just gonna go with this first because I just know it's not gonna work. I'm gonna go with my Maybelline lipstick in Nude Lust. You can see it a little bit <laughs> when I try to blend it out by blotting my lips. Very ashy tone. This is not it. Now we're gonna go with the next uh, pencil and this is in Malt. I don't know, this, you know, because I'm Haitian and when I say malt, when I think about malt, I'm thinking about Malta. So. I'm gonna tell you now, I love malt. I'm going to go with the same lipstick from Maybelline called No Lust in 920. Like this. This gives me a real nude, you know? It has a red undertone. But not so now we're gonna go with my third lip liner and this is um what is it? Morphe in Trendset. This one too. Let me go with everybody all time favorite, and y'all already know which one this is Mac Chestnut. This is my favorite lip liner, MAC Chestnut. Like, she's just that girl. Moth, this is my winter shade, okay guys? My favorite lip color in the winter. Hue. Mm. This is my winter shade. So this is my final review on my lip liners and also on the Anastasia um, lip liners. So you guys know I really can't wear this one and this one malt, which makes me thirsty for malt because you know all oh, Haitians love malt. Anywho, so. I have to say it glides on 
so smoothly. It does remind me of the Kylie lip liners. And what I like about the Kylie lip liners is how creamy it is. This is very creamy. Slides on very smooth um, on your lips. I had not a lip balm, nothing on. And I didn't feel like it was tearing at my lips. So I think this is what we're missing in the industry is the creaminess of lip liners. So yes, I like that about that. But um... Y'all already know that girl is a MAC chestnut. That's what I have on my lips with some gloss. Like, that's that girl because she goes with everybody. I've always used MAC chestnut. I've tried several other lipsticks. They're either too dry. I tried high-end, low-end, and I have to say what compares to it is this Anastasia Beverly Hills, and it's the creaminess. I love the color of the chestnut. If MAC can match the creaminess of the Anastasia, they'll be winning. So MAC chestnut will always be my favorite. And like, you don't need a lot of lip liners, especially if you're going on vacation. I've been on plenty vacations and let me tell you, my makeup kit is very simple, which I have to do a vlog or a video on that. I, it, I just take the basics and I still look mom. So, and I always take one lip liner and that is the MAC Chestnut. So, I know if you're a professional makeup artist, you have this in your kit. I like Nice Moth, but I only wear that during um, the winter. Um, yeah. So, that's my review. Thank you guys for watching.